Dear viewers, for the past two days, some pictures of Bollywood's King Shah Rukh Khan have been circulating on social media, which are from his recent Umrah pilgrimage. In these photos and videos, Shah Rukh Khan can be seen performing the circumambulation of the Kaaba. He is in the state of Ihram, pilgrimage attire, wearing a mask and accompanied by a few other people. As soon as these pictures were shared on social media, people started asking if Shah Rukh Khan had recently performed Umrah or if these were old photos. In today's video, we will provide you with detailed information about this, including what happened during his Umrah. We will also discuss when and why Shah Rukh Khan arrived in Saudi Arabia and what activities he was involved in after performing Umrah. So, make sure to watch this video till the end. Before we proceed, we request all our new viewers to subscribe to our channel and press the bell icon so that you receive all our upcoming videos on time. Respected viewers, Shah Rukh Khan is also known as the King Khan of Bollywood. There is no doubt that Shah Rukh Khan's fan following is not limited to India, but spans across the entire world. He is immensely popular, and wherever people understand Urdu and Hindi, Shah Rukh Khan's fans are present. They not only enjoy his films, but are also admirers of his acting and unique style. This is why, regarding Shah Rukh Khan and other Muslim Bollywood stars, a question is often raised. Are they still connected to Islam? Or have they abandoned their faith for the sake of the industry? Dear viewers, it is crucial to clarify two things. Allah has prescribed only one outward worship for Muslims, which is the offering of Salah, prayer. The call to prayer, Adhan, is given, and men are commanded to go to the mosque. Salah is an external form of worship, intended to attract others towards it when they see a Muslim praying. However, other forms of worship are matters of the heart, involving your connection with Allah, and do not need to be made public. Therefore, the nature of one's faith and relationship with Allah is a personal matter between the individual and Allah. It should not be a topic for debate or questioning. Regarding Bollywood stars from time to time, videos and photos emerge that suggest they are still connected to their faith, such as the recent images of Shah Rukh Khan performing Umrah, which are circulating on social media. In reality, Shah Rukh Khan was in Saudi Arabia for the shooting of his upcoming film. Once the film's shooting was completed, Shah Rukh Khan had a few more days left in Saudi Arabia. He decided to perform Umrah during this time. He traveled to Mecca and performed Umrah at Masjid Al-Haram. Interestingly, he was not accompanied by a large security entourage or crowd, but performed the Umrah like an ordinary person. He was seen in Ihram attire, wearing a mask, yet people recognized him and shared his videos and photos on social media. In these videos and photos, it is noticeable that Shah Rukh Khan did not stop to take pictures with any fans. Instead, people captured videos and photos from the side or behind him while he was performing Umrah. This gives the impression that he simply wanted to perform the pilgrimage without engaging with others or drawing attention, likely out of respect for the sanctity of Masjid al-Haram. After completing Umrah, Shah Rukh Khan remained in Saudi Arabia for a few more days, particularly for the second edition of the International Film Festival in Saudi Arabia. He had also attended the previous edition last year, but this time he was awarded the Best Actor Award. Films from Pakistan, India, Egypt, the UAE and other Arab countries were previewed at this festival, and awards were given to the Best Actors, Actresses and other participants. Shah Rukh Khan, after winning the award, congratulated the Saudi organizers for hosting such an excellent event and expressed hope for more events like this in Saudi Arabia in the future. However, viewers, many people who are sharing Shah Rukh Khan's Umrah photos and videos, as well as Muslims from around the world, expressed strong reactions about the film festivals, concerts and dance shows held in Saudi Arabia. They voiced concerns that such events should not take place in Saudi Arabia, given the presence of the Chibla there, and hoped that Islamic traditions and culture would be respected in Saudi Arabia. Nonetheless, the Saudi government has changed its plan regarding this. Prospected viewers, what are your thoughts about Shah Rukh Khan's Umrah? Do let us know in the comments section. Additionally, please share your opinion on the 2030 plan being implemented by the Saudi government. When talking about Gulf countries, including the UAE and other Arab states, 
It seems that Qatar's role during the recent FIFA World Cup has raised questions about whether the leadership of the Muslim world might shift away from Saudi Arabia. However, viewers, this is not the main topic of today's video. If you would like a separate detailed video on this subject, please let us know in the comments section. Now, let's talk about other Muslim celebrities from Bollywood who have performed Hajj and Umrah before. The first name that comes up is Mr. Perfectionist Amir Khan, who performed Hajj with his mother in 2012. He met Shahid Khan Afridi, the late Junaid Jamshed, and Maulana Tariq Jamil during this trip, which was a lengthy meeting discussed by both Amir Khan and Maulana Tariq Jamil in various interviews. Next is A.R. Rahman, who performed Hajj twice, once in 2004 and again in 2006. A. R. Rahman was born into a Hindu family, but later converted to Islam. He is considered the most successful playback singer in Bollywood, and performing Hajj on his birthday was particularly special for him, which he regarded as a gift from Allah. Similarly, actress Gawahar Khan's name comes up, as she has also performed Umrah and appeared very happy about it. What are your thoughts on these actors and actresses performing Hajj and Umrah? Please share your opinions in the comments section, like and share this video, and before leaving, don't forget to subscribe to our channel so you can receive all our latest videos on time. O oh Allah, I ask you for your mercy and forgiveness. I seek refuge in you from all harm and evil. O oh Allah, guide me to the straight path, the path of those whom you have blessed, not of those who have gone astray. O oh Allah, forgive me my parents, my family, and all the Muslims. Bestow upon us your mercy, O oh the most merciful. Cleanse our hearts from hypocrisy, our deeds from showing off, and our tongues from falsehood. O oh Allah, I ask you for your love, the love of those who love you, and the love of deeds that bring me closer to your love. O oh Allah, make faith beloved to me and beautify it in my heart. Make disbelief, wickedness, and disobedience hateful to me. O oh Allah, grant me sincerity in my worship and actions. O oh Allah, I ask you for paradise and everything that brings me closer to it, in word and deed. I seek refuge in you from the fire and everything that brings me closer to it, in word and deed. O oh Allah, protect me from the trials of life and death and the torment of the grave. O oh Allah, forgive my sins, those of the past and the future, what I have done openly and secretly. You are the most merciful of those who show mercy. O oh Allah, I ask you for well-being in this world and the hereafter. O Allah, protect me from illness, sadness, and grief. Grant me patience, contentment, and ease in all matters. O Allah, I seek refuge in you from anxiety and sorrow, from weakness and laziness, from miserliness and cowardice, from being overcome by debt and from the oppression of people. O Allah, you are the most forgiving, and you love to forgive, so forgive me. Pardon me for all my shortcomings and sins, and grant me a heart full of faith and contentment. O oh Allah, you are the one who hears our prayers. You are close to us, responding to our supplications. O oh Allah, grant us from yourself mercy and guidance. Ease our difficulties, remove our burdens, and provide for us sustenance from sources we could never imagine.